thee. I will give thanks to thy name, O Lord, for it is good. For you have delivered me from every trouble in mine eyes, have looked in triumph on my enemies. Give ear to my prayer, O Lord, and hide not thyself from my supplication. Attend to me and answer me, I am overcome by my trouble. I am distraught by the noise of my enemy, because the oppression of the wicked. They bring trouble upon me, and in anger they cherish enmity against me. My heart is in anguish within me, and the terrors of death and followed upon me. Fear and trembling come upon me, and horror overwhelms me. And I say, oh, that I had wings like a dove, I would fly away and be at rest. Yea, I would wander afar, I would lodge in the wilderness. I would haste to find me a shelter from the raging wind and tempest. Destroy their plans, O Lord, confuse their tongues, for I see violence and strife in the city. Day and night they go around it on its walls, and mischief and trouble are within it. Ruin is in its midst, and oppression and fraud do not depart from its marketplace. It is not an enemy that taunts me that I could bear it. It is not an adversary who deals with insolent with me that I could hide from him. It is you, my equal, my companion, my familiar friend. We used to hold sweet converse together within God's house. We walked in fellowship. Let death come upon them. Let them go down to Sheol alive. Let them go away in their terror into their graves. But I call upon God and the Lord will save me. Evening and morning and at noon I utter my complaint and moan. He will hear my voice and he will deliver my soul in the safety of the, from the battle that I wage. For many arrayed against me, God will give ear and humble them. He who is enthroned from old because they keep no law and do not fear God. My companion stretched out, stretched out his hands against his friends. He's violated his covenant. His speech was smoother than butter, yet war was in his heart. His words were softer than oil, yet they were drawn swords. Cast your burden on the Lord, and he will sustain you. He will never permit the righteous to be moved. For thou, O Lord, will cast them down into the lowest pit. Men of blood and treachery shall not live out half their days, but I will trust in you. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High, who abides in the shadow of the Almighty, will say to the Lord, my refuge and my fortress, my God, in whom I trust. For he will deliver you from the snare of the fowler and from the deadly pestilence. He will cover you with his pinions, and under his wings you will find refuge. His faithfulness is a shield and buckler. You will not fear the terror of the night, nor the arrow that flies by day, nor the pestilence that starks in darkness, nor the destruction that wastes at noonday. A thousand may fall at your side, ten thousand at your right hand, but it will not come near you. You will only look with your eyes to see the recompense of the wicked. Because you have made the Lord your refuge, the most high your habitation, no evil shall befall you, and no scourge come near your tent. For he will give angels to charge of you and guard you in all your ways. On their hands they will bear you up, lest you dash your foot against a stone. You will tread on the lion and the adder, the young lion, the serpent you will trample underfoot. Because he cleaves to me in love, I will deliver him. I will protect him because he knows my name. When he calls to me, I will answer him. I will be with him in my tr in trouble. I will rescue him and honor him. With long life, I will satisfy him and show him my salvation. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory to you, O God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory to you, O God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory to you, O God. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. When the women disciples of the Lord learned from the angel the joyous message of your resurrection, they cast away the ancestral curse, and had lately told the apostles, Death is overthrown, Christ God is risen, granting the world great mercy. Now and ever and unto ages of ages, amen. As there is no boldness because of the multitude of our sins, do you, O Virgin Theotokos, intercede with the Son whom you have borne? For the entreaty of a mother has great power to win the favor of the master. Despise not, O venerable lady, the prayers of sinners. For he took upon himself to suffer for our sake. He is merciful and strong to save. Let thy tender mercies, O Lord, speedily go before us. For we are becoming exceedingly poor. Help us, O God of our salvation, for the glory of thy name. O Lord, deliver us and purge away our sins for thy name's sake. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, mortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, cleanse from our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal infirmities for your name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. 
Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. O Master, teacher of wisdom, bestower of virtue, who teach the thoughtless and protect the poor, strengthen and enlighten my heart, O word of the Father. Let me not restrain my mouth from crying to you. Have mercy on me, a transgressor. O merciful Lord. Lord, have mercy. 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 You who art every season, and every hour, and in heaven, on earth, art worshiped and glorified, O Christ, our God, who art long suffering, merciful, and compassionate who loves the just and shows mercy upon the sinner, who calls all to salvation through the promise of blessings to come. O Lord, in this hour, receive our supplications and direct our lives according to your commandments. Sanctify our souls, hallow our bodies, correct our thoughts, cleanse our minds, deliver us from all tribulations, evil and distress. Compass us about with your holy angels that guided and guarded by them. We may attain to the unity of the faith, and to the knowledge of the unapproachable glory. If you are blessed unto ages of ages, amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages, amen. More honorable than the cherubim, more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without defilement, you gave birth to God the Word. Truth, Theotokos, we magnify you. In the name of the Lord, give the blessing, Father. O God, the Lord of hosts, the author of all creation, who in thine ineffable tender mercy has sent down thine only begotten Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, for the salvation of our kind, and through his holy cross has torn up the handwriting of our sins, and thereby triumph over the princes and dominions of darkness. Do you, O Master, who loves mankind, accept these prayers of thanksgiving and supplication, even from us sinners, and deliver us from every deadly and dark transgression, and from all the visible and invisible enemies that seek to do us harm. Nail our flesh with the fear of thee, and let not our hearts incline to evil words or thoughts, but wound our souls with thy love, that ever gazing upon thee, guided by the light and beholding thee, the eternal light that no man can approach, we send up unceasing prayers and thanks to thee, the Father without beginning, together with thy only begotten Son, and thy most holy, good, and life-giving Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. and of the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. In peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the peace from above and for the salvation of our souls, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For the peace of the whole world, for the stability of the Holy Church of God, and for the unity of all, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For this holy house and for those who enter it with faith, reverence and the fear of God. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For our Metropolitan Tikhon, for Archbishop Mark, Locum Tenis of Albany and Archdiocese, for the Honorable Presbyterate, for the Deaconate in Christ, and for all the clergy and the laity, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. 
for our country, for the president, for all in public service. Let us pray to the Lord. For this city and for every city and land, and for the faithful who live in them, let us pray to the Lord. Above the abundance of the fruits of the earth, and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For those who travel by land, sea, and air, for the sick, the suffering, the captives, for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For our deliverance from affliction, wrath, danger, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Lord, have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, pure, blessed, glorious Lady, the Mother of God and the Virgin Mary. With all the saints, let us commend ourselves one another in our whole life to Christ our God. Glory. For to belong all glory, honor, and worship to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and today, just of ages. Amen. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. Blessed are you, O oh Lord. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. And all that is within me, bless his holy name, bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and forget not all his benefits, who forgives all your iniquities, who heals all your diseases, the Lord, in his compassion and Long suffering and of great goodness, bless the Lord, O oh my soul. Blessed are you, O Lord. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy upon us, and keep. Protect us, O God, by your grace. Lord, have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, pure, blessed, and glorious Lady, the Autocos, and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend ourselves, one another, and our whole life to Christ, our God. the dominion and yours to the kingdom, the power and the glory of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Praise the Lord. I will praise the Lord as long as I live. I will sing praises to my God while I am being. When not your trust in princes and sons of men, in whom there is no salvation, when his breath departs, he returns to his earth on the very day his plans perish. The Lord will reign forever, thy God of Zion to all generations, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Only begotten Son and immortal Word of God, 
who for our salvation will to be incarnate of the holy Theotokos and of the Virgin Mary, who without change became man and was crucified, who art one of the holy Trinity, glorified with the Father and the Holy Spirit, O Christ our God, trampling down death by death, save us. Here again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Lord have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, pure, blessed, glorious Lady Theotokos and our Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend ourselves in one another and our whole life to Christ our God. Good and loving kind, and to be open up glory to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. In the kingdom, remember us, O Lord, when thou comest into thy kingdom. Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they shall inherit the earth. Blessed who on earth are set to righteousness, for they shall be filled. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the sons of God. Blessed are they that are persecuted for righteousness sake, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are you, and men shall revile you and persecute you. And shall say all manner of evil against you falsely for my sake. Rejoice and be exceedingly glad, for great is your reward in heaven. Son of God, save us who sing to you. Alleluia. When the women disciples of the Lord learned from the angel the joyous message of your resurrection, they cast away the ancestral curse, and elatedly told the apostles, Death is overthrown, Christ our God is risen, granting the world great mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Master, teacher of wisdom, bestower of virtue, who teach 
the thoughtless and protect the poor. Strengthen and enlighten the heart. O word of the Father, let me not restrain my mouth from crying to you. Have mercy on me, a transgressor, O merciful one. Now and ever and unto ages of ages, amen. The grave from your mouth the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever, and today, just so Now our, 
Our salvation is nearer than when we first believed. The night is far spent, the day is at hand. Therefore, let us cast off the works of darkness and let us put on the armor of light. Let us walk honestly as in the day, not in revelry and drunkenness, not in debauchery and wantonness, not in strife and envy. Rather, let us clothe ourselves with the Lord Jesus Christ and fulfilling the needs of the flesh, transform them not into lust. Receive him that is weak in the faith, not disputing over opinions. For one believes he may eat all things, but another who is weak eats only herbs. Let not him that he eats despite him that he eats not. And let not him that he eats not pass judgment on him that he eats. For God hath received him. Who art thou to judge another man's servant? It is before his own master that he stands or he falls. Yea, he shall be made to stand. For God is able to make him stand. It is good to give thanks to the Lord, to sing your praises to your name, O Most High. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. To declare your mercy in the morning and your truth by night. Consumes and where thieves 
do not break in and steal. For where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. Glory to you, O Lord, glory to you. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. We are standing on the thresholds of great fast. The period which was initially prescribed to catechumens, to the people who were getting ready to be baptized on the day or before the day of Pascha. Forty days for them were prescribed to go symbolically same way as you Hebrew people in wilderness for years and also the same Lord, our Lord, Jesus Christ, was fasting during 40 days in wilderness. Symbolically, we need to repeat same way as all humankind passed through. Initially, we were created, we came to this life to fulfill the plan, the godly plan, to live happy life, in pleasure, in kindness. We were created this community. We are not created to be alone and go to paradise or live alone this life or achieve something for only our personal gain. This is the mystery of Holy Trinity, how to live in absolute total harmony with other personalities. Main thing, main sin, sin which distorts the human's image which is created in God's image is our egocentric assumption of being in existence, our existence. As we understand ourselves, the only ones alone, and even in families, with our family and dear persons, sometimes we ask, we live according to our personal benefit. If something goes wrong in family, we easily wake up even with our beloved persons. We have many divorces, conflicts inside the family. So humans need to harmonize their lives to live together, to manage happiness not as individual achievement or purpose or goal, but as purpose and goal of our society. We are social beings. 
but we can't do it. Even the first person created as perfect being, they couldn't achieve this. Immediately they began to separate themselves from others. First they tried to separate themselves from God, and when they separate themselves from God, they understand that they, they are individuality. It is tragedy, and we live in a tragical world. These 40 days symbolically presents our humankind's life through wilderness which we created by ourselves. When you separate yourself from others, when you became self-consumed, after you separate free, ruined space around you, you became lonely. You became one only person. You live like only one. Exactly which is wilderness when you are alone. Lonely. Last week I last Sunday I talked about Borido. This is the wilderness. And we are destined to live this wilderness. We are tragic, tragically born already in this kind of condition. That's why gave, God gave us this opportunity to live symbolically life in short term during 40 days to make ourselves to concentrate for meaning, for a destiny, true meaning, a true destiny of our being, our existence, our lives. Who we are, where are we going? What is our relationship with others? How I set my world? Do I make this world full with other human beings as wilderness for myself or I can cohabit with other individuals trying to build up with them together one peaceful community. This is the main reason why we began these days, 40 days of concentration and discipline with forgiveness to reconcile to reconcile with other human beings from whom we separate ourselves in everyday basis. We think we make first step towards God making this 40 day of our lives as way towards the God, to reconciliation with God. But in this way, on this way, we meet all the personalities. We can't reach God without reaching to our other human beings. We can't be forgiven and ask forgiveness, ask be accepted if we don't accept others. Giving forgiveness to others, forgive to others, actually we forgive ourselves. Give opportunity to God to grasp us from inside us. It is necessary, it is unavoidable. Without forgiveness and reconciliation, we can't we can live our lives. 
you make mistakes. Civilization is full of mistakes. But humankind progresses only when there is a reconciliation. In each family, we have these problem, problems among the members of one family. But if family members try to forgive each other, help each other, their hearts are open, this family lasts even during the hard time. Forgiveness is necessary. Otherwise, we are going to lose even our identity, even our individuality. Either we reconcile with each other, we try to gain others, and they gain us, or we disappear as a human, as icon of God's love. Amen. Let us say with all our souls and our mind, let us say, O Lord Almighty God, our fathers, we pray unto you, hear us, and have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Furthermore, we pray for all pious and orthodox Christians, hear us, and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for Metropolitan Tick and for Archbishop Mar, local tenants of the Albanian Archdiocese, for the priests, deacons, and all other clergy, and for all our brothers and sisters in Christ. Hear us in heaven. Mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Furthermore, we pray for the President of our country. For all civil authorities, for the armed forces, hear us and have mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Furthermore, we pray for the blessed and ever memorable founders of this holy temple, and for all our fathers, mothers, brothers, and sisters, especially Archbishop Nikon, the victims in Ukraine. Luca, Basilica, Tuta, Paul, George, Deacon Stephen, all of the servicemen and women who have fallen asleep in the Lord. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Furthermore, we pray for those who have lost their lives because of the war in Ukraine. That the Lord our God may look upon them with mercy and give them rest where there is neither sickness nor sorrow, but life everlasting. Hear us and have mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Furthermore, we pray for mercy, peace, life, health, salvation, remission of sins of your servant. The brothers and sisters of this holy parish, and Archbishop Mark, Archimandrite Nicodem, the people in Ukraine, the Thodori family, the Thodori family, Joyce, James, Janice, Julius, Stephanos, Maria, Evangelina, Virginia, Dimitar, Elias, Pandeli, Lefteri, Lefteri, all of the men and women serving in armed forces, hear us and have mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy.
Furthermore, we pray for mercy, life, peace, health, and salvation for those who are suffering, wounded, grieving, or displaced because of the war in Ukraine. Let us hear, let us hear us and have mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. For the more we pray for those who be frozen do good works in this holy temple, for those who labor in its service, for the singers, for the people here present, who wait to receive your great and rich mercies, hear us and have mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. For you are gracious and merciful God, who love mankind, and to his face send up glory to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Let us the faithful again and again in peace. Pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Praise the Father unto we are due of glory, honor, and worship to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever, to the ages of ages. Amen. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Protected by your mind, we may offer glory to you, to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen.
of our sins and transgressions, let us ask the Lord. Grant it, O Lord. For that which is good and beneficial for our souls and for peace for the world, let us ask the Lord. Grant it, O Lord. That we may complete the remaining time of our life in peace and repentance, let us ask the Lord. Grant it, O Lord. For a Christian end to our lives, peaceful without shame and suffering, and for a good defense before the awesome judgment seat of Christ, let us ask the Lord. Grant it, O Lord. Commemorating our most holy, pure, blessed, glorious Lady, the Theotokos, and ever virgin. Mary, with all the sins that us command ourselves on another in our whole life to Christ our God. To you, Lord. Through the mercies of your only begotten Son, with whom we are blessed together with your holy and life-giving Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. be. Watch the deep heaven and to your spirit. 
Sfânta Doamne, ritie trigete de feimenea mionde. Let us love one another, that is one is of mine, we may confess. Ave, Son, and Holy Spirit, the Trinity, one in essence, The doors, the doors, in wisdom, let us be attentive. I believe in one God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and all things visible and invisible. And in one Lord, Jesus Christ, the Son of God, the only begotten, begotten of the Father before all ages. Light from light, true God from true God, begotten not made, of one essence with the Father, through whom all things were made, who for us men, for our salvation, came down from heaven, and was incarnate of the Holy Spirit, and the Virgin Mary, and became man, and he was crucified for us in the conscious power, and suffered and was buried, and on the third day he rose according to the scriptures. And he ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of the Father. And he will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom is not heaven. And in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father, who with the Father and the Son is worshiped and glorified, who has spoken to the prophets, in one holy Catholic and apostolic church, I confess one baptism for the remission of sins. I look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Let us turn right, let us stand in awe. Let us be attentive that we may present the holy offering in peace. A sacrifice of praise. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and love of God and Father and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Let us lift up our hearts. Let us lift up our hearts. We lift them up unto the Lord. the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, the Trinity, one in essence, and undivided. Singing the triumphal hymn, exclaiming, proclaiming, and saying, Blessed is he that comes in 
Taking. This is my body which is broken for you for the remission of sin. Amen. Drink of this, all of you. This is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for you and for many for the remission of sin. Your own, of your own, we offer to you in all and for all. Especially for our most holy, pure, blessed, glorious Lady, the Theotokos, and ever Virgin Mary. It is truly me to bless you, O Theotokos, ever blessed and most pure and the Mother of our God, more honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without defilement you gave birth to God the world. True Theotokos, we magnify you. Among the first to remember, Lord, our Metropolitan Tichem and Mark Logum Tenet of the Albanian Archdiocese, grant them to your holy churches in peace, safety, honor, and health unto length of day, rightly teaching the word of your truth. And remember those whom each of us has in mind and all the people. Grant that with one voice and one heart we may glorify and praise your most honored and majestic name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and through the ages of ages. Amen. And the mercies of our great God and Savior Jesus Christ be with you all. Having commemorated all the saints again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For the precious gifts represented and concentrated, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. That our God who loves mankind, having accepted them at his holy and celestial and mystical altar as an offering of spiritual fragrance, may it turn send down upon us the divine grace and the gift of the Holy Spirit. Let us pray. Lord Having asked for the unity of the faith and for the communion of the Holy Spirit, let us commend ourselves and one another in our whole life to Christ our God. To you, Lord. 
and grant us master with boldness and without condemnation to dare call the all the heavenly God, Father, and to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Unto you, thank you. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Peace be with you all. And to your spirit. Let us bow our heads to the Lord. Grace, compassion, and love for mankind of your only begotten Son, with whom you are blessed and together with your holy, good and like giving spirit, now and forever to the ages of ages. Let us be attentive. The holy gifts for the holy people of God. One is holy, one is the Lord Jesus Christ, through the glory of God the With the fear of God, faith and love, draw near. Blessed is he that comes in the name of the Lord. God is the Lord and has revealed himself to us.
never be hungry, and whoever believes in me will hey. never be thirsty. Nicholas. to you that you have seen me and yet do not believe. Everything that the Father gives me will come to me, and anyone who comes to me I will never drive away. For I have come down from heaven not to do my own will, but the will of him who sent me. that I should lose nothing of all that he has given me, but raise it up on the last day. Receive the body of Christ. Taste the fountain of immortality. How is it going? Good. Having prayed for the paradise, have 
be partaker of the divine, holy, pure, immortal, heavenly life created in awesome mysteries of Christ, let us worthily give thanks to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy upon us and protect us, O God, for your grace. Having prayed for the perfect, holy, peaceful, sinless day, let us commend ourselves with another and our whole life to Christ our God. Through you all. For you are our sanctification to give glory to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Let us go forth in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. O Lord, who bless those who bless you and sanctifies those who put their trust in you. Save your people and bless your inheritance. Protect the whole body of your church. Sanctify those who love the beauty of your house. Glorify them in return by divine power and forsake us not who have set our hope in you. Grant peace to your world, to your church, to the clergy, to our civic leaders, and to armed forces, and to all your people. For every good and perfect gift you are about coming down from you, the Father of light, to we give glory, thanks and worship to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever, into the ages of ages. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord, it's forth and forevermore. Blessed be the name of the Lord, it's forth and forevermore. Blessed be the name of the Lord, it's forth and forevermore. May the blessing of the Lord and His mercy come upon you. By his divine grace and love for mankind, always, now, and forever, and ever. Amen. Glory to you, God, our hope, glory to you. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Father. Bless. They who rose from the dead, Christ our true God, through the intercession of His all pure and all immaculate Mother of God, and our Father among the saints, John Christ, the Son, Archbishop of Constantinople. And all the saints have mercy on us and save us for his good and love of mankind. Amen. <clears throat> uh, as I mentioned already, we have uh, small service now. The prayers of Sunday of forgiveness. And I think my sermon was quite long. So I had intention to speak about the hymns here but it's enough for today let's decide it for next year i'm not going anywhere so 10 years you will listen the same and same again let's let's spare now some things not spare some things so we will have small service here forgiveness and Vladimir, please approach. This service actually is done.
very different ways in different parishes. There's so many traditions to do it. And some parishes are doing every other year differently. I don't know how you have done it past years. He is now expert here. And he will now will tell us exactly how we are doing it. Okay, like, like it was last year. Remember? Okay, turn toward them. Huh? On them. Hey, tell them. Explain exactly what we are going to do. As the traditions we've been doing in the past several years, I know that we have, um, at the conclusion of the, the prayers, we'll just approach the Father for them to, to receive a blessing and uh, ask forgiveness of each other in whatever form we'd like to in terms of a, in a kiss or a handshake or whatever we'd like to ask. Where, where they are going to stand? How they are going to stand? So we are standing this way. So we need to do it by your, by your way, as you have done. Let me see it and after next year I will not call you. Okay. So you are coming to me and I just, as, as usual, I will give the cross and you will kiss the cross or, or give me something to say. And it is easy. Blessed is our God, always, now, and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, mortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Most holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, cleanse us of our sins, master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your name's sake. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the King and power and the glory of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever, to the ages of ages. Amen. Let us humble the flesh by abstinence, as we follow the divine path of pure fasting. With prayers and tears, let us seek out the Lord who saves us. Let us put an end to anger, crying out. Save us, for we have sinned against you. Save us, O Christ our King, as you saved the man of Nineveh. And make us partakers of your heavenly kingdom, O compassionate one. When I think of the many deeds, O Lord, I am filled with despair, and know that I am worthy of every torment. I have despised your commandments, O Savior. I have spent my life as a prodigal. I pray to you, only merciful one. Cleanse me by repentance. Enlighten me through the first and fasting. And despise me not, O most gracious benefactor of all. Let us begin the fast with joy. Let us prepare ourselves for spiritual efforts. Let us cleanse our soul and cleanse our flesh. Let us abstain from every passion as we abstain from food. Let us rejoice in virtues of the Spirit and fulfill them in love, that we all may see the passion of Christ our God and rejoice in spirit at the Holy Pascha. Lord, have mercy, Lord. 
Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Mercy, Lord, have mercy. O Lord, who help every person to accomplish good, come to the aid of your servants and prosper for work of our hands. We pray you, Almighty Master, hear us and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. O oh, good one, preserve us from any harm. Defend us against the attack of visible and visible enemies. And assist in its successful accomplishment, we pray you, O oh, most good Savior, hear us and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. O oh, Lord, you have ordered us to do all things for your glory. Bless your servants, say we begin our fast, and that we might complete it with success and satisfaction. Grant us the health and length of day. O gracious Creator, hear us. Mercy. Mercy, Lord, have mercy. Hear us, O God, our Savior, the hope of all ends of the earth and of those far off upon the sea, and show mercy, show mercy, O Master, upon us, sinners. Amen. For you are a merciful God, who love me. Kind and to the open of glory to the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and today, Jesus of Amen. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. O oh Lord Jesus Christ, our God, accept the prayers and bless the good intentions and the and the fast of our, your servants. May we successfully begin, begin in form your glory and complaint without any obstacle. Guide our hands and by the power of the Holy Spirit, may our labor be peaceful, accomplished, for yours is death. For it is to show mercy and to save us. O oh, our God, I unto you we offer glory, together with your Father, who is from everlasting, and your holy good and life giving spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. the praise of our Holy Father, O oh Lord Jesus Christ, God, have mercy on us and save us. Amen. Sanctified liturgy. Uh, Wednesday, six o'clock. I ask Sergi to make it online. It will be a beautiful service. We will keep it on. And uh, I hope we will all together will have and will celebrate beautiful Pascha Day. Amen. Uh, forgive me. Now I am approximately two months with you. So I'm sure that I already did something wrong. <laughs> Maybe the first day. So about this, I really truly ask you forgiveness. Any in advance, I ask you forgiveness, be compassionate with me. As for us priests, we always pray for our parishion. If sometimes we are wrong, not good person, still the prayers there makes us to pray for you. 
we don't have any choice not to forgive you. But we also pray that you forgive each other. We need to forgive actually everybody. So like you know how evil works. Chain is chain. Somebody upsets you, you are upset, you upset another, you upset another, it goes on, goes on, and comes again to you. It goes to China, Arab countries, Arctica, and comes back to you. So we need to cut this chain. We need to forgive. Whenever you forgive, guys, whenever you forgive, we always cut some kind, this kind of chain. Some kind, he will we cut it down. So, forgive me, and God forgive you all. I mean, please approach. Yes, home blessings as always. Now, home name blessings will not be for theophany. When I came uh, in January and February, when I come, I changed the theophany, troparion. Now I will change other through far. The difference is not a big deal, but still. I'm always open to you guys. You can anytime call me whatever is you think. Whatever you have need or not need it, just enjoy our company. We are together and we will continue to be together. And please take initiatives. Okay? Be initiative. It's three ways. You Americans like to be proactive. From Balkanian countries and from Black Sea, they are the Mediterraneans, and we are not so proactive. But so, may, please do it. Do it. Be a, it is, you know, reactive, active, and proactive. Reactive you are when you are, you just do whatever is needed to be done. Active is when you are trying something to do. But proactive is when you don't see any problem, but still you just don't. Don't produce problems. Just do something. <laughs> Be proactive. Do whatever you want, whatever you think. Hear the parish council. Here am I. Am I. Let's, let's do. Now, how many you are? Every other Sunday, new people are coming. If you come together, everybody, we need other church to build. Don't know. <laughs> if everybody will come here, we need to buy their other church. Where is the Catholics? Just take them out <laughs> and take the other church. God bless you. Forgive me. Forgive me, my dear. Is it? Thank you. Hey, Elizabeth, you best gentle ever. <laughs> forgive me, guys. And God, God, forgive me. Forgive me, and God, forgive me. God, forgive me. Forgive me, guys. <laughs> For, forgive me all. Elizabeth, are you dancing here? She is just dancing. Don't think that she's. No. <laughs> she's dancing. Ah, what are you going to me? How it is signal me? Signal me. Oh, it's not signal. Signal me in Greek. Chief. Mandia. 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 What is this? Yes. Feel it's, me? It's, it's basically feel uh, forgiveness from your heart. Ah, okay, okay. Mandia. Oh, Mandia. 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 That's right. Mandia. Mandia. Oh. Mandia. Mandia. Mendes. Mendes. Yes? Mendes. Shoe. You say shoe. They don't say shoe. You say shoe. Mendes. <laughs> okay. Mendes. 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 This is the right way. In the edge. In the edge. In the edge. Want to call for the edge. In the edge. 
Hey, you forgive me? You don't care, yeah? <laughs> Okay. So look, now I try. Mendies? Mendies? Mendies, pa. Sure, sir. Oh, in middle. Oh, come. <laughs> ah, Mendies. No, no, no. I can make it easier. Mendies. Mendies. No, sure, no, sir. Okay. Mendies. Mendies. I'm going to make it easier. Okay. Mendies. Where is your Independence Day? How uh, is November. November. Ah, we passed it. Okay. We will do it. Mendie is singular. Mendie. Mendieni. 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 Sigro, mi para galo, ne? Αυτό είναι εμείς συγχωράμε έναν τον άλλο. Τώρα εγώ συγχωρήσέ μου. Σου λέω να συγχωράμε και με τη συγχώρηση να πάμε και να ανιστεύουμε όλη την νηστεία αυτό. Ναι, ναι, συγχωρώ όπως είναι στο Πάτερ ημών, Πάτερ ημών, εκεί. Λέτε, συγχωράμε και παίρνουμε συγχώρηση. Εγώ δεν τώρα θα κάνω. Αλλά δεν είναι έτσι στο Ισπανία. Αλβανία δεν είναι τι να γι' αυτό σα είπα. Εγώ σα είπα ότι κάθε ενορία, κάθε ενορία κάνει διαφορετικά. Αλβανίδα, αλλά δεν είναι έτσι στην Αλβανία. Forgive me. I am doing how they are doing here. Όπω κάνουν εδώ, κάνω έτσι και εγώ. Ναι, για λε. Ακόμα στην Ελλάδα δεν κάνουν έτσι. Κάνουν εδώ στην Αμερική, δεν κάνουν. Δεν μπορεί να καταλάβει. Forgive me, yes. Mendes. Mendes. Hey, beautiful girl, Mendies. 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 Kalimera. Kalimera, so Kalimera. Oh my God. Mendies. 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 Good. Mendies. Yes. Mendies. Hello, guys. Mendes. Where are you from now? From Albania or not? You are Americans. American. You are American. Yeah, you are not Albanian. <laughs> Kay. Yes. Hi. Kai. You need to change your name. <laughs> Sisters. Ah, oh, yeah. So you are Albanians, but not Albanians. They like them. Father, forgive me. You have to teach me that. Oh, thank you. Oh, Theos, na se sikhoris na pis. Be forgiven. Oh, Vladimir, it is your your, your style. It is your style now. <laughs> Look, yes, we have time now to talk about Pesasco because their book says some different things there. Mendie, you are Albanian? Yeah. You are Albanian, yes. Mendie. Mendie. Forgive me. Forgive me, Anze. They are here for the baptism and got caught up. Yes, what time, what time we have? 12.30. So, so now, uh, yeah, we have, have not this one, yes, we are showing some. Well, I put some water in there, and then I'll have the one that he can stand in, in front of it. Yeah, just, so, yeah, here or here? Up here. Up here, up here. yes, because here, but who is? Up here, and I'll put towels around, because okay. um, it gets very wet. So. Well, they are waiting. Ah. Okay. 